Hello, welcome to Fantasy Star Online 2. Um, we're pretty much just making our way to the capital of the Wayland Empire and uh, also learning that stuff going on in Omega is causing problems for us out in the real world, or specifically that the profound darkness is absorbing everything the black hole absorbs and becoming way more powerful. So we gotta move fast. But first, we gotta go through an army of corpses. Get it hope and Malf and Sina continued forward even as their sight wore thinner and thinner. A man flashed a courageous smile as he accompanied the pair toward the Imperial City. The Guardian, Gedemholt, and Melfensina made their way toward the Imperial capital, demolishing Castrum Demonicas along their way. The Castrum Demonica was originally Cuento technology, but they were laid out across Wayland with as much precision as in Cuento. Given how deeply ingrained the Castrum Demonicas were, the Guardian and company began to question the true nature of their history. Castrum Demonicas were a Quinto invention, yet there's so many in Wayland. That's because once the technology was leaked, the Emperor decreed that they be summoned in all regions. Hmm. Sounds like the Emperor of Wayland is pretty familiar with sorcery and stuff. He clawed his way to the throne with demonization. So, he's a capable sorcerer in his own right. But... It ain't that blasted Emperor summoning Castrum Demonicus. It's Elmir. Who's Elmir? It's the damnable Emperor's used tissue of a kid brother. Cocky little snot. They looked far enough apart age-wise that they might as well be father and son. It's clear that Wayland has hit rock bottom as a result of the Emperor and Elmir both. Rock bottom? How rude! We simply breathed some life into a listless land. Elmir? What are you doing here? I heard someone was breaking my finely crafted Castrum Demonicas. So, I came out here to do a little field survey, as it were. You're the one I'm here to see. The guardian that alighted upon Cuento. Yes, yes, very interesting. I can sense incredible potential from you. Small wonder you can crush Castrum Demonicas. Between the Castrum Demonicas and Guardian, I must say, Quinto never fails to put out quality products. You think you can just waltz out here? You got guts, Imperial baby brother! My goodness, you're a loud one. I'm not interested in you, test subject. Would you mind staying out of this? No beef with me? Too bad! You're still getting the horns! What? If you're spoiling for a fight, you can play with your fellow defective fiend troopers for a bit. No. It can't be them. They should be dead. You catch on quickly. <laughs> I suppose that's why you're a test subject. Call them Castrum Demonica Fiend Trooper Hybrids, if you will. Did you swap out the monsters summoned by Castrum Demonica for Fiend Troopers? <gasps> Precisely. After all, I had plenty of material to work with. They're all lacking in ability, but they make for acceptable enough soldiers. I owe it to them to make proper use of them. Otherwise, they'd die in vain. It wouldn't Oops, it's beyond it. the pale. They got some sweet armor though. <laughs> 
Shut your filthy mouth, you little shit stain. You think you can mess with us? I'm gonna murder you and that bastard emperor! My, how spirited. Go ahead. Trample the corpses of your friends to reach us. <laughs> Okay, dokey. Oh no, my meg. I'd be hungry all the goddamn time. deteriorated from the fiend trooper experiments we endure. We have no time to waste at all. But if you strain yourself in that condition... We can deal. Our lives are a small price to pay. It ain't about how long your life is. It's what you do with it that matters. I ain't... I ain't getting nothing. Like the ones we just mowed down. I'm gonna slay that damn emperor myself! While the sentiment is appreciated, I'm with Gedimholt on this. That, and. We wouldn't even know who we were mourning. I wouldn't want to associate them with... this. They're both beside themselves with anger. Even I can tell. We can't allow this cruelty to go unchecked. We have to put a stop to it. One more cutscene. You're back, Elmir. You look like you had an amusing enough time. Oh, amusing doesn't begin to cover it. I'm positively thrilled at how rapidly things are progressing. It's even better than I imagine. We'll have a prime specimen by the time it arrives. <laughs> then we must be amply prepared to give them a fitting reception. So long now I've been trapped in languor, but now my blood is pumping again! <laughs> then I'll leave you to it, brother. The end of the ultimate struggle. After raising the castrum to Monica, the Guardian had finally reached the Imperial capital. They now stood face to face with Emperor... Schreger in the la in the latter's throne room, ensconded in an uneasy quiet. The 
Castum Demonicas were summoned the realm over and loaded with a superhuman vanguard. The Guardian's group pressed onward, refusing to be cowed by the vanguard's howls of resentment. When they reached the Imperial capital, they found it cloaked in eerie stillness, almost as though it was devoid of all life. It was fitting indeed that the only one to reside there was the Emperor himself. Shreger, Emperor of Wayland, Shredder. awaited the coming of his nemesis, alone in the silence. You're here. Are you the Wayland Emperor? Indeed I am. Shreger, Emperor of Wayland. I must thank you for coming, Guardian. <laughs> oh, he finally meets you, you cursed Emperor! You will pay dearly for toying not only with people's lives, but with a whole nation! <laughs> toying with a nation? I'm Emperor. It's my nation to toy with as I please. If you don't like it, strike me down. That's what I empowered you for. Isn't that right, test subjects? What's the point of giving someone power through modifications they don't even want? Hmm. Without power, one's fate is to perish. Might makes right in this world, period. The weak can only submit to this reality. Surely you've lived long enough to grasp that. Right, Guardian? You didn't get this strong without trampling countless corpses underfoot. Whether man or beast, there is no morality in slaughter. All fall the same. Might makes right. That's the one universal truth of the world. Which is why Wayland has long focused on evolving its people with strength transcendent. Now it comes to a head! We have but to push this war across the world and seize even greater might. No further discussion is necessary. Strike me down with your justice! If you think you can! Oh good. One of him. A false no, and it's got false fun with it. Is it the ephemera? No, the details are too accurate for this to be a coincidence. Now there's no question that Ephemera is part of the Profound Darkness. <laughs> oh, hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about! So much for any moral ambiguity. Slay the monster, and we win. Monster eats us, and we lose. That's good enough for me! Shreger, Emperor of Wayland, I will use the last of my life. To end yours! Here we go. Insignificant! Sure, you are done already? <laughs> you measure me! Code! You! In your depths, give me power! <laughs> Get a clue! Insignificant! <laughs> I'm not sure how you missed me with that last time. Oh, 
Yeah, let me help you guys out. What foolishness! My power has been dispersed. No, has it been consumed? <laughs> Now I see, Guardian. Your power is strange indeed. But that, that makes it all the more worthwhile to take! than you? Is that really all you wanted? Let's go. Get him Holt. The Emperor may be dead, but our battle is far from over. I am far from finished. I will leave a wedge in this world. Get him up! Sina! You okay? Yes, I'm just fine. This body's quite responsive, actually. What? What the? This wasn't the body I was trying to snatch, but it's surprisingly nice. It will suffice for a temporary vessel. You took over her body? Demonization is the art of channeling magic into the body. I simply applied that to its logical conclusion. No need to act so surprised. A vessel has no need of two souls. The weaker soul will vanish, and the stronger will remain. <laughs> you can do the math, I'm sure. You're telling me... Scene is gone? Bullshit! Well, for someone mortally wounded, but I can tell you have minutes at most left. Damn it! <laughs> Did you have feelings for this body? <laughs> Content yourself in death, knowing that you amused me to the last. Shit! Seen this body. Ain't yours to... <coughs> no, no, you're only hurting yourself talking! Leave this failure to die and let's enjoy a fight again, shall we, Guardian? You will find me far different from my previous battered body. You don't have the heart to cut this body down? Then you shall perish, for absolute justice lies with the victor! What the... 
<laughs> My body's not obeying me. Sina. Get him hold. Guardian. I don't want this. I beg of you. Kill me. And the Emperor. <laughs> The doomable wench still persists. Not for much longer. What? You should be dead. How dare you? Maybe I should be. But I got my pride. I ain't gonna drop dead. That's what she asked for! Get him home. What are you doing? I hate to say it, but I am in no shape to slay the Emperor. But I can give you my power. Let my soul empower you! Maybe that's a dick move to pull, but screw doing nothing. Screw dying with my thumbs up my ass! Here goes! Cena's not gonna like it, but too bad! Man, first Elder eats me, now I'm friggin' guardian food? <laughs> oh, ain't karma a bitch. I always got the impression you smelled like me, ever since I first ran into you on Nevarius. Turns out it was because you assimilated me. <laughs> I ain't even gonna question it at this point. It's all just random Akashic Records crap anyway. No point in trying to puzzle it out. Go on, take it. You could use Elder's power right about now. And save her. Show me that chicken shit way you operate. G get him, Holt's photons just went into you. No, these are. Oh, Look, well, it's colored how I already colored it. Three on one, actually. We entrust our wills to you. Give them hell with everything you've got. Idea what that was? No idea at all. The readings were identical to those of Dark Falls Elder, but all oh, right, Melfoncina. Hey, I'm calling in my favor now. Hey. 
Cena. We look like a regular pair of dumbasses, huh? We sure do, Adam Holt. Instead of shielding you, I let myself get used against you. <laughs> you must have looked real stupid. Well, it's done with now. This meddler made sure of that. Yes, I saw. The Guardian always delivers, I suppose. Thank you. Truly. It's been... a long road. <laughs> You're damn right about that. I'm... kinda tired. Nobody will mind if I... take a little rest. Will they? <laughs> they don't get to whine when they rest first. Then... I think I'm gonna rest. Sure. I'll see you around. Get them hold. See you around, Sina. This is the end for us. The end for memories of a record construct, Cena. <sighs> and a dead guy. But it ain't your final chapter. You got a crap ton of stuff left to do. Ephemera and the Castrum Demonicas. The insidious roots that erode this world. There should still be plenty of Castrum Demonicas left within Wayland's borders. We have to get rid of them. We owe it to those two. Man, I really need to spend those XP on them. Now things will get really interesting. Slowly becoming, as I mentioned throughout this let's play already, the anti-profound darkness. The Dark Force Collective will be mine. And that's where I'm going to end it for the day. I've already colored them, right? Yeah, I colored you. Yep. I like how they show the colors in the cutscene. I wasn't expecting that for some reason. Alright, anyway. Stopping here. Thanks for watching.